Welcome back everyone. My name is Two Planker and this is Sky Factory 3.0, a year in the life. So our trees are maturing nicely. We've got our crops going. We've got it in three different sections. I'm waiting to get another growth stone uh, or growth pulse to put here before I start growing um, the inferium over there. And we're also making better seeds. I've been downstairs. I've been trying to craft up some better seeds. But today what we're going to do is we're going to take all of this ore that we're getting uh, the pieces for. We're going to combine them. And we're going to smelt them. And we have a furnace here. But what we're going to do, let's take this furnace out. There we go. Using the inferium seeds that we've or the plants that we've got, the essence, not the seeds, the essence. If we come down here, as we saw last time, I'm crafting everything through here. Um, they're making all the way up to the supreme essence. And I'm getting some supreme essence. Now you'll notice here that I've got some blocks of the different essences along with just some of the uh, individual essences. What we're going to do is we're going to take a furnace. Let's take one of each of these. And now we'll just take all of these down. We're not going to use them all. We're going to make a really high powered furnace. So we start like this. And I believe it's, let me think, is it this? Oh, I'm going to have to look it up. My bad. It is just three. I thought all the squares were used, but they're not. Okay. So we've, we've got the Inferium Furnace. So let's go to the next level. Prudentium Furnace. Um, it's this one next. Intermedium Furnace. We're getting there. It's a, it's a premium furnace. And finally, it's, a, <laughs> it's just spelled slightly different. Okay, so we've got 100% efficiency on this one. Let's uh, put all of this essence back in the chest. Let it build. Let's go back upstairs. And what we're going to do is we're going to put this right here. Now, I already, yeah, I've already got a chest. You can see I put the coal in. And we will extract without a signal. And we're inserting. Then over here, what we're going to do is we're going to take just take one of that, one of that, one of that. And I built the high-end filters, the advanced item filters, which gives us, what is it, 10 spots? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 spots. So we should be able, everything's coming in. Now we've got a white label here, so we'll put in that one. Let's just do a test here. And then on this side, what we're going to do is we're going to blacklist these. I said white label. It's a white list. So let's go like this. Blacklist. Extract. Okay, good. You're extracting. There we go. Now they should be going into here. And then we'll make recipes for each of them that and that's going to go to the external Let's apply that now we're going to extract without a signal there we go and we're going to insert there we go because it's got to go in the top perfect oh my goodness gracious such a noob okay so we've got there that now what we're going to have to do it is coming out the bottom. Can I get down here? No, I'm, we're going to have to go downstairs and look at it. Do I have any blocks with me? I do not. Let's grab some blocks. There. OK, 
Okay, let's make sure that it's extracting out of the furnace properly. And it'll start going into the chest. Let's get up there and look at it. We're going to extract without a signal. There. Let's go have a look. And we're going to have to make some new chests. But we'll get the final type of get the uh, actual ingots. Now, do I have any extra chests over here? I've got some upgrades. Uh, let's just make make three. Two, three. There we go. But I've only got two upgrades. Now let's see. Okay, did it go over? It did go. Nice. So that's how we're going to deal with all of the ores now. So obviously any of the iron that's coming through should be should get filtered into here and we're going to have to do this with all the ores there. Excellent. Now what we can do is how many there's a lot of stacks in there that's going to take me a while to clean up. But with this furnace let me just organize things here for just a second. Um, get that out of the way, out of the way. Let's put that out of the way. There, we're going to need how many of these? Stack limit 160, that should be good for this moment. I'm just moving everything out. Actually, diamond, that diamond could go back too. There we go. Now. Okay, let's see how fast this goes through. Put it all in the chest. I'll pull it out fairly quickly. Gets put into the actual chunks. Goes through the furnace, and this furnace is so fast. That's why we got this. That's why we built this furnace. As you can see how fast it goes through. So we should see this one just going up like crazy, and we are. Perfect. So that's working. We're going to do that with all the ores. And I will set up. I want to try and clean some of these out. I don't want to add too many more drawers at the end. So clean these up and get those working, and I'll be right back. Now that we've turned all of the ores into ingots, we're good to go. It's all set up now. So now that that's done, I, lo I like these plants. These are pretty cool. And we've got a white chicken. Hi, white chicken. Got a sand chicken. There's a sand chicken. I think if we breed them. I'm not sure what we get if we got any, uh, any grains over here. Let's go get some. Sand on the ground. Let's see if we can make some other kind of chicken. Lots of sand chickens around here. But let's try and get... Where's that white guy? Come here, Bones. Hey. Come here, Sand. You guys want to hang out? What are you? You're a sand chicken. Hmm, okay. And that's missing a plant. Need one more for there. Now, what we want to do, or what I think we should do, is... 
we've got tier 3. We need more tier 4. Now, the tier 3, I think what we have to do... Is it like this? And that'll give us tier 4s. Okay. So we need... But, what's the other thing? Oh, what are these ones? These are already tier 4s. Okay, so we need all those. Let's have that. How many stacks is that going to give us? Let's go like that. 36. Because it's 8 per stack, I think, isn't it? There's tier 4. Still have 25 to go. That's three more stacks. Oops. Should have done that without. Because I think if we move all the way up into a tier 5 seed, it grows super fast. And that's what we want, is just a whole bunch of production out of these. Okay, tier 4. Tier 3. What tier is that one that's missing upstairs? I think those might only be ones. Uh, where is it? So these are inferior crops. Okay. Are they all? No, these are intermediate. So these are inferior. So. Oh, look at you guys. Who are you? You're a flint chicken. What happens if we get a flint and, or a white and a flint? Anything? What are you? You're a flint chicken. Okay. All right. I was hoping to get something different. We are going to have to make a chicken farm here eventually, I think. I'm not sure which way we're going to put it. You know the one thing that we do need also, or that we do need, are cows. I want leather. Now, ooh, bad frame rate there. I'm losing all kinds of frames. Still got to figure out what to put on that front wall. It's just so plain. But that's where our spawning station is, our spawning area for the mobs. You know, I was watching one of Ethos videos and he's got dark glass and I think that might be the answer. If we're going to make something for animals, I'm wondering if we should go out here and make like its own little island. Go up maybe I don't know. Eight, ten stairs or levels, and then a nice big platform. That might be the way to go. We're getting the setting sun over. It's setting, correct? Yeah. Get the setting sun over there. Oh, here's what I wanted to do. This is what we need to do. We need to update this book. We are way, way far into it. Okay. Where are we here? Wood age. Everything's done in the wood age. Where are we? Yes, we've sifted. We've constructed tinkers. We've made clay. We've crafted and cooked a crucible. We have a bunch downstairs. We heat a crucible with a torch. Yes. And we put in cobble. We built a cobblestone generator. In fact, we've got a couple. We made a dark room 25 blocks away for spawning. Yes, we did. We made a grass field 25 blocks away from our base. You know, that's... Hmm. That's one. There's that thump, thump, thump noise from... And that's the mob grinder. I wish the manufacturer, or the uh, mod builders would fix that sound on it. I'm not sure how to fix it. Hey, if you've got an idea, let me know. If you know how to fix that sound. 
Now we've had animals spawn over here on grass. Now is that 25 blocks away from, like our original spawn was right in this area somewhere. I think. So. I don't know. We've had animals spawn, so I'm pretty sure. Or 25. Build a second layer, yeah. Make obsidian with stone, yes we've done that. We've made a smell tree for processing ore. Now the biggest difference between the smell tree and using the high powered furnace is that with the high powered furnace we only get one to one. Uh, one nugget or one of the ores, a complete ore, make a single ingot. Whereas in the smell tree, a single ore made two ingots. You get double, but it's faster. This way it's faster. Upgrade. You know, that is something we haven't done. We have not upgraded an existing tinker's tool with a metal part. Let's go do that right now. We've got some... You know where we... Are they in here? No. I think... What do we've got down? What do we have down here? I, uh, the loot bags. In the loot bags, we've got some really good... Metals, I believe. Or ores. No, not that one. So we've got cobalt. Should we try and do that? This cobalt is a hard material, isn't it? Just sit there and stare at it. It'll make it go faster. I know it will. I think it's so fun just to sit here and watch the mobs go zipping across the glass, down, and into the grinder. Didn't have to put up with that noise. That would make it excellent, but... Yeah, it's just fun watching them to come down. Alright, are we done yet? Okay. Please be enough. Oh. Uh, let's put our ingot one back. And go look in the chest. Now let's go back upstairs. The tinkers. Should we move the tinkers downstairs now? I still kind of like it up here. Um. Okay, so what do we go from? Interesting. 1.2, 4.9. Durability 812, mining speed 55. Where are we going here? 55 mine. Hmm. So it's a little faster attack speed. Attack damage is the same. Interesting. Okay, well, just looking at all the stats. Must be a little bit better, but we've completed that uh, quest. Automate your cobble, yes. Kill your, uh, upgrade your mob farm to kill monsters automatically, oh yeah. Oh yeah. We definitely have that. Okay, what else do we have? We have not made a watering can, we have not captured a cow in a jar. We have prepared a farming space for several crops. We have got, well, that one there where we've got the grains, and now we haven't automated it yet. There's that thump thump. Hmm, and the reeds. But we definitely have automated the uh, seeds, or uh, the inferium. So yes and yes. We have made a mattock. We've st um, we have started f well food farm. I guess that's our apples. Since we've been drinking apple juice, wouldn't our f uh, food farm be our orchard? Prove to the world that sand grows sure came faster than dirt with a block of snad. Oh, we have not done that. So this is what we're working on. We'll work on the farming age. But...
we were able to get quite a few quests done, or quite a few check marks in the book. Next time we'll get to uh, see if we can make all four of these ones. Yeah, in fact, that should be pretty easy. Yeah, you got any suggestions of what we can put on the front of that? It's just right now we can't make any windows unless we use dark glass. I'm going to have to look that up and see what is the, um, what's involved with making that. But we should have enough. We should have enough resources. And it rains once again. So, on that note, I think we'll end the episode here. Thank you very much for watching. Love to hear your comments. Please subscribe, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye now.